Teledyne E2V, previously known as E2V, is a global manufacturer with its headquarters in England that designs, develops and manufactures technology systems and components in healthcare, life sciences, space, transportation, defence and security and industrial markets. The company was previously known as English Electric Valve Company and for a short time Marconi Applied Technologies. E2V was acquired by U.S. company Teledyne Technologies in March 2017. <laughs> company history The company began in the early 1940s as a part of the Marconi Group, manufacturing magnetrons for defense radar systems. The company was first registered as a separate company in Chelmsford, Essex in 1947 under Semon Eisenstein. Its initial name was the Phoenix Dynamo Co. Ltd., though it immediately changed its name to English Electric Valve Company Ltd. In 1959 Bob Colson established traveling wave tube and microwave tube sections and they were producing ceramic hydrogen thyrotrons as well. By this time EEV was the largest high-tech manufacturing company in the UK. A year later they won an Emmy Award for Outstanding Contribution to Electronics Technology in developing the 4 and a half tube. In 1961 they acquired the Associated Electrical Industries valve business based in Lincoln. Sir Charles Oakley was a director of the company from 1966 to 1985. In 1962, EEV opened its first office in America in Buffalo, New York. The company has received 13 Queen's Awards for technology in its history, most recently in 2006 for low-light imaging devices and in 2004 for thyrotrons for cancer radiotherapy treatment. Also, in 1972, they opened an office in Paris, France and in 1977 they opened another office in NY but this time in Elmsford. Keith Atwood, E2V CEO from 1999 to 2013 led E2V through a short period as Marconi Applied Technologies, and then in 2002 he led a management buyout supported by 3i following the collapse of the Marconi Group. Following further growth under 3i, in 2004 the company floated on the London Stock Exchange. In 2017, E2V was acquired by Teledyne Technologies and changed its name to Teledyne E2V. Business profile In its final annual report prior to acquisition, namely for the 12 months ending March 2016, E2V's turnover was £236.4 million, of which 44% was generated from its imaging division, 34% from radiofrequency power products and 22% from semiconductors, and it employed around 1,600 staff across nine engineering facilities and six sales offices. Its profit before tax for the same period was £37.60 Minnesota. Awards <inaudible> 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 The company has received 13 Queen's Awards for technology in its history, most recently in 2006 for low-light imaging devices and in 2004 for thyrotrons for cancer radiotherapy treatment. Hugh Menown, responsible for developing double cathode and hollow anode thyrotrons, was awarded the MBE in 1982. In 2013, E2V was awarded the Sir Arthur Clarke Award for Outstanding Achievements by a Team in Space Activities. Acquisitions 
In 2005, E2V purchased Gresham Scientific Instruments, renamed E2V Scientific Instruments, and sold in 2012 to SGX Sensatec. In 2006, it purchased the Grenoble, France facility from the Atmel Corporation in 2006, now renamed E2V Semiconductors, and Mike's Microchemical Systems based in Corsel, Switzerland, renamed E2V Microsystems and sold to SGX Sensatec in 2012, and in October 2008 E2V acquired QP Semiconductor, a US-based designer and supplier of specialty semiconductor components used in military and aerospace applications, establishing E2V's first U.S. manufacturing base. In 2014 E2V acquired Anafocus, based in Seville, Spain, a designer and manufacturer of specialist CMOS imaging product. In 2016, E2V acquired Signal Processing Devices Sweden AB. In March 2017, E2V itself was acquired by Teledyne Technologies for some £627 million Minnesota and changed its name to Teledyne E2V. The U.S. acquisition followed 70 years to the month after the original English company's registration in 1947. In its 2018 annual report, Teledyne Technologies said the final purchase price for E2V was $740.6 million, net of cash acquired as part of the business, adding that E2V had been Teledyne's largest acquisition in its history. Clients <laughs> <laughs> In 2009 E2V's Charge Coupled Devices CCDs, a type of space imaging device, were fitted to the Hubble telescope as part of an upgrade project. In 2010, the company announced the establishment of the E2V Microwave Engineering Centre in Lincoln, UK as part of a restructuring that saw the move of operational capabilities to the Chelmsford facility. In 2013 E2V supplied the CCD imaging array for the European Space Agency's ESA's Gaia project to map the Milky Way. At 1 billion pixels this is the largest image sensor flown into space. In 2015, CCDs made by E2V enabled crisp images of Pluto to be transmitted by NASA's New Horizons probe, which launched from Earth ten years earlier, the same NASA probe and CCDs almost four years later, in early 2019, transmitted images of Ultima Thule, an object located in the Kuiper Belt, an outer ring of our solar system. As of 2018, E2V was one of the suppliers of CCDs for the Large Synoptic Survey Telescope. It is also a supplier of CCDs to ESA for its FLEX satellite, which will study plant health and stress from space and is scheduled for launch into Earth orbit in 2022-23. Major clients include Airbus, Boeing, Thales Group The University of Nottingham Siemens ESA CareStream Health Rockwell Collins Raytheon Tomotherapy JAXA NASA Andor Technology Global operations With its HQ in Chelmsford, Essex, England, E2V has two UK-based design, development and manufacturing facilities Chelmsford, Lincoln, one in Grenoble, France, one in Seville, Spain, and one in Milpitas, US. It also has an operational base with customer support facilities in Beijing, China. Over 30% of the staff are engineers or scientists. E2V also has sales, service, and technical support offices in the UK, North America, France, Japan, Korea, and Hong Kong. 
Chelmsford UK HQ for E2V Northern European Regional Sales Office Milpitas US – Design, Development and Manufacturing Facility specializing in aerospace and defense high rail semiconductor solutions Grenoble France – Design, Development and Manufacturing Facility specializing in semiconductors Seville Spain – Design, Development and Manufacturing Facility specializing in imaging Lincoln UK – Design, Development and Manufacturing Facility specializing in microwave electronics New York US – America's Regional Sales Office Paris France – Southern European Regional Sales Office Beijing China – Regional Operational Support Hong Kong – Asia Pacific Regional Sales Office Taipei Taiwan – Regional Procurement Office Tokyo Japan – Regional Sales Support Seoul Korea – Regional Sales Support Products and services Topic RF Power Defense Electronic Countermeasures Radiotherapy Cancer Treatment Machines Radar Systems Stellar Satellite Communications Amplifiers Industrial Heating and Bulk Materials Processing Missile Control Safety and Arming Devices Digital Television Transmitters High Performance Imaging Space and Earth Observation Imaging Science and Life Science Imaging Machine Vision Ophthalmology Dental X-ray Systems Topic high reliability semiconductors life cycle management high reliability microprocessors high speed data converters high reliability ICs with lifetime continuity of supply QP semi product line assembly and test services MRAMs <laughs>